it's in the book, but could you tell us why Christians aren't happy? Uh, what? Why Christians? This is what you did last time. Yeah. Why? Why are not? Why are? Why aren't Christians yeah. happy? Happy. And why are they not happy? They're not happy. Yeah, they're, they're Christians, not. but they're not happy. Yeah, the Christians. The reason why they are not happy. One of the major thing I can say that it, which causes them not to be happy. They are too much worried with their day-to-day life. Mm. They think much about what to eat, what to drink, what to put on. And they, when they start thinking all about that, they get worried. And they, 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 they lose all the joy. Mm-hmm. That's why Jesus said that don't get worried about what you are eat, what you shall put on, uh, what you, your children will eat, because God can feed the animals, the birds. God can close, can close even the weeds, and they look great. So God who can do that, he can also do that for you. So when you engage to get worried about this day-to-day life, what to eat, what to you end up losing your joy. But uh, someone who is not worried about that, who is only trusting in God, even if he has food or not, he will remain happy because his joy is not in food, his joy in God. Whether he has clothes, that will not be a problem because all his heart is not after clothes, but he is desperate for God all the time. Instead of having more, he need more of Jesus, he need more of God, that's what he's desiring so much. I need you more. So what could cause him to get worried? The day he wakes up and feel the presence of God is very far from him mm-hmm. or from her, that could cause him to get worried and be like David. That's what one of the biggest worry David had, the King David. Remember even when he fornicated and uh, killed his, uh, the husband, one of the things he cried to God, he said, please don't take away your presence from me. Don't take away. That was too much on him. He couldn't bear it. He could go without clothes, but living without the presence of God, that would be difficult for him. 